Hello guys and welcome to my channel. So before I start the reading, I wanted to thank everyone who uh, actually supported me about the last video and I read all your comments. Uh, thank you so much. You are so supportive and you don't even know how much more strength you gave, gave to me and uh, even more courage to do other readings for you. Um, try new things uh, so i see you enjoy my readings most of you and uh, really truly thank you thank you so much guys i blow kisses to you if you can hear but i hope you can feel uh as much as you gave me the strength and those energies you sent to me and your comments everything uh, i send you thousand times more <laughs> right now i hope you can feel it i really really appreciate you guys and hopefully uh we'll get even more uh entertained readings in the future so today's reading i wanted to do about their thoughts and feelings um so just quick check on their feelings the person you're asking about you can also ask about several people if you want uh, and um, we're gonna have three piles today we're gonna have three piles about their current thoughts and feelings pile number one pile number two and pile number three uh let me put some numbers for you as well one two and three what is it interestingly number three is really hiding from me right now yes here it is so maybe this person is hiding their feelings but we'll see okay so just use your intuition uh usually it works within like three to five seconds but you can also pause the video and choose your pile i'll give you some time Another thing I want to do here um, is um, add certain messages from their soul, what their soul wants to tell you today, okay? I'll just add some messages here. For pile, <coughs> pile number one, pile number two, and pile number three. okay perfect so i hope you picked your pile already and we are going to start so pile number one what are their current thoughts and feelings for you mm. They are planning on something in regards to you. What are they planning for? Let's see. Well, first of all, they're planning to talk to you and it's about uh, they wanna either come back or if maybe you had certain difficulties or misunderstandings, they wanna fix it. They wanna, you know, clear things out between you two. Uh, they also want to come maybe with certain um, gift or just uh, words of uh, telling you that they love you, that there are feelings, and I see yes. But uh, they're not sure how you're going to re react to them because maybe they broke your heart in the past or maybe they said something you didn't like or maybe you got into a fight or it could be anything. But what they want to tell you, they want to give you this cup, cup of love. 
what else yes they want to be uh, to be fair with you they want to clear things out so they know you deserve everything best and they want to bring it to you um what else let's see in another deck what else are they thinking yes uh they feel like you don't trust them in a way you they feel like you don't trust them maybe they did you wrong before maybe they cheated or uh betrayed you or just hurt you in a way and now they want to fix this but they're not sure uh did you forgive them yet are you still thinking about them are you still remembering them if you like in a long pause maybe uh also they're thinking will you ac ac accept them um they also think you are the magician who knows what um, they want in their life. Let's say if you decided to leave this person, uh, you will do it. So they're not sure if you will let them uh, this chance to come back. Yes, they really hurt you here, I feel, pile number one. Maybe not now, maybe in the past. And that's why this trust is gone on your side. Even though you want them, even though you still have feelings, both of you I feel here, you still have certain feelings, but you are not trusting them as much as you did before. And they see that you've changed a bit, like at least a bit. You've changed and now you know exactly what you want. Yes. And what you want is a, a family, something stable at least, and not this uh, game mind or... Um, mind game you want stability stability in feelings stability in a uh, relationship and disconnection you don't want their hot and cold stuff you don't want them to disappear to go in a uh, pause mode and maybe not contacting you um often or just like go away and then suddenly come back you're tired of this you don't want this in your life anymore and they have they're aware of this and they trying and planning how to you know bring you back but you know what i want to see here are they gonna actually um did they change or this is going to be the same scenario again have they changed yes i feel they changed in a way they've gone through a certain transformation they realized your work they realized that you are the empress and you deserve a, to be in a family or at least in some stable connection when they don't hurt you they've been through certain transformation it took some them quite some time they realized again your worth and now they're trying to turn this wheel uh and uh start things over but in a different scenario now at least yes now they want to want to work on this relationship now it's different at least on their side um let me see their feelings and the other deck i see this person have changed and i see that it took them quite long time maybe they broke your heart several times they uh, it, it's like this situation is already for years even maybe that you struggling with them but this time something happened sub, something clicked to them and uh, now they're realizing uh, things so what are their feelings when it comes to you yes they want to end this um instability of um come and go situation because the chariot usually it's like hot and cold come and go person is not stable so they want to end it with the world they want to start a new cycle with you where uh, you're going to be more stable couple with the eight of wands this is uh, people who enjoy each other um, f and, and want to be there for a long term okay there is like a stairs uh, going up which means that um, there is a certain future they're thinking about with you, something more stable, okay? So yes, there are feelings, but they're more mature feelings. Uh, of course, there is a lot of passion too here. 
Yes, and t exactly, and Ten of Pentacles. It always, it, that's like one of the best cards in the deck. Uh, Ten of Pentacles talks about family, stability. This person likes you to the point where they wanna uh, even have a family with you. Of course, this is a general re reading, but uh, I think you know what I mean here, okay? So, exactly, and Ten of Cups. So you have two tens here. And for me, it's like they're tired already from uh, this in, in unstable connection. They're tired of this pain they bring to you. Also, just for some, if this person, if this is a triangle situation, this person is tired to be where they are and they want to come to you. Okay? Could be too. And let's see certain message from them, from their soul, from their unconscious in regards to you, pile number one exactly that's just what we talked about they're tired to play hot and cold with you wow this resonates so much this hot and cold brings them pain as well they're tired of this game and uh they want to bring everything good to you this time at least they're trying to but of course it's always up to you do you want to uh, accept this person or you don't anymore maybe you already moved on so that that was it pile number one thank you for uh, watching uh, let me know in comments how it resonated with you or it, if it didn't uh please like subscribe and i'll see you soon guys bye bye Okay, whoever chose pile number two. So let's see. Uh, what are they thinking about you today? What are their thoughts and feelings? First, we're going to look at their uh, thoughts, okay? So what are they thinking about you? Wow, the tower. So something happened here. Either you got into a fight, uh, you separated, you divorced, maybe you just broke up. Or maybe this is, was a big argument here where things um, went so fast, un unexpected, and uh, you don't even know how you got here, okay? So this pile, definitely something is going on here. If you're uh, just in a, a stable, quiet uh, connection right now, this is not your pile. This pile, something's going on here, and let's see. Yes, there was a certain betrayal or um, somebody hurt someone. Uh, cheating could be anything anything that uh, brought a lot of pain and uh, disappointment look at this all these disappointing cards maybe you are disappointed in them or they are in your both ways something's really going on here something uh, uh, that maybe made you cut this person off or they cut you uh, it depends on your situation but uh, what are they thinking they're thinking that uh, if it's you that you cut them off, they're really sad about it. They don't know what to do. They're they they're in shock. That's what I feel. They they're in shock that um this even happened. They're so surprised. If let's say just an example, if uh, they cheated on you and you somehow found out, right? Just an example. Uh, this person really shocked. Uh, how did you find out? They were sure you would never find this out or maybe they lied to you in certain way that hurt you and they maybe didn't even think such thing can hurt you uh, and uh, they actually did okay okay let's see what else are they thinking yes they really uh they really want to come to you come forward and uh explain their, themselves if it's them who hurt you um but they're also watching you somewhere they watching and sometimes they, right now they're really aggressive right now those energies are kind of aggressive it could also be you or both of you 
uh, they don't really get how to fix it right now they don't know how to fix this right now they're in uh, their lowest energies right now so I don't even suggest you um, even touch them right now because they are not in their best energies what else are they thinking They're thinking that uh, they have feelings for you and they want to fix it. They want to fix it with the uh, six of pentacles. They want to um, give you this equal give and take. They want stability with you. They want to finally figure things out because they have feelings. Uh, but they don't know how. They don't know how. Let's see what else are they thinking. Maybe something they're not telling you right now. What are they thinking about you? Yes, either you left or you just, uh, you know, turn your back to them. Like, I don't want this anymore. I'm tired. I'm done with you. Or maybe it was them. Doesn't matter. They still regret it. And um, for some, maybe, maybe even they flirted with someone and you saw it or something like that. Something silly even maybe. But still, you decided that was the <clears throat> ending point where you realize, okay, this person cannot give me what I want this person always brings me pain let's say <clears throat> so you deciding to leave this connection because you are uh, the ace of earth you are a stable person who deserves stability and you know your worth you know your power you know what you deserve and uh, you see that this person as of now is very mature and cannot give you this uh, um, stability uh, could be they are in a fire sign or you a fire sign uh, doesn't have to be or an earth sign yes and what you want here you want uh, this um, you want this calmness that uh, you you want to be sure in them like be you want tr you want to trust this person you want to trust your person that you have feelings for but they don't let you uh, this stability they just give you pain, struggle, sorrow, I don't know, madness even for some. Yes, you're really tired of the situation. It it, it, it freaks you out. It's like you're like, okay, I'm done. I'm done. Uh, we cannot be together. We don't match well. It could be also you from different religions, different uh, beliefs, different... Uh, nationalities or maybe you live at a distance from each other i don't know could be a lot of difference maybe just different in opinions maybe this person said okay i'm done um you know good for me whatever you do is not for me you shock me all the time you do those things that i don't understand where are they coming from why are you doing this to me i'm done with you i want to move on that's that's i feel your energies yes i feel this is your energies more it could be um the other person but i feel more that you just left the situation for at least for now to think it over what else yes this person is really hurting you a lot uh even though they have feelings we didn't look at feelings yet but i already feel it here even though they have feelings but more what they have is um their immaturity just brings you pain but let's look at their feelings here what are their feelings? What are their feelings, pile number two? Yes, they have feelings for you, of course. But also they have may could be jealous or you jealous or um, they think you have someone else already maybe. Or maybe they're just not doing anything. Maybe they're just sitting there and um, not even moving your way. So you decided to be a bit uh, far energetically from them and think it over because you don't want uh, such person. You Yeah, you left or you did something that uh, you left the situation. You want in your future to be with a person who's more stable like the king of pentacles. Could be an earth sign or doesn't have to be. It's just uh, you want this person that will give you stability, that will... Uh, that will not give you uh, uncertainties, that will give you something that uh, 
they will protect you in a way and this person uh, just brings you pain and you, and I see there is like emotional attachment to this person of course on a sexual level especially could be but um, you are in your power right now you are so powerful right now that you decided okay I'm done uh, either this person must change or uh, I'm just done with them that's that's your energies right now pile number three and let's see what this person wants to tell you their soul uh-huh lyrics okay uh expect that you might hear certain lyrics and that will be a message from your person maybe you're gonna listen to certain song or something that where you will uh hear certain words that will click to, to you that's coming from them from their soul also it could be you have uh, some lyri lyrics uh, with this person that you usually maybe listen to a certain song or something listen to it again because this person really wants to send you certain message right now okay that was it pile number two uh let me know in comments if it resonated with you um please like subscribe and i'll see you soon guys bye bye Okay, whoever chose pile number three. Let's see, guys, what are their thoughts and feelings for you today? At the moment you're watching, this is a timeless reading. So first, let's see what are their thoughts for you. Wow. So right away, I want to say this person is about to contact you. So let me know later on if they did. <laughs> because I feel it could be within a week or so, eight days, because this is eight of ones. Within eight days or so they want to contact you they, there will be um ready they are ready to contact you if you're not in communication even if you are this person wants to contact you they have passion for you and let's see what else that's what that yes be, why because they have feelings for you this person definitely wants to contact you they're also watching you somewhere could be social media or somewhere else so this person is really aimed for you to come to you yes they have feelings they're ready to you know open up maybe they're gonna tell you that they love you uh, this week or so within the eight days maybe they're gonna uh, open up with their feelings to you or just uh, maybe they're gonna come and um, give you certain gift or uh, do something nice for you try to help uh, but you would feel a lot of love coming from this person and energetically This person is really missing you right now um, because I see this candle is like a bit dripping and uh, it tells me right now that this person misses you. Even if you like nothing happened here, uh, you are totally fine. You just want to know their thoughts. Uh, still, they're missing you and that's why they want to contact you uh, very strongly. What else? Uh huh. Yes, if something happened between you before or right now going on, they're done with it. They only want to look into the future with you. They're done with this. They've been through a certain transformation. They're done with this uh, negative thoughts or fears. They're done. They could also be done with their fears. If they were fearing to come towards you, maybe this is your secret admirer, right? I don't know who you're asking about. Uh, they could have like finally find the strength in them to approach you and tell you exactly how they feel and what they want with you in the future. This person finally have courage to come towards and open up. 
Wow, beautiful pile number three. Yes, it could be for a long time they couldn't open up to you. Uh, and now finally it's the time. Because they adore you so much. They they feel that you are so attractive. You uh, have such a great energies in you. And they like being with you, near you. They like uh, seeing you, smelling you, touching you, if they already have connection with you. Yes, a lot of sexual... Look at this, two cards talking about sexual attraction. A lot of sexual attraction coming your way. Uh, if you didn't have sex yet, they really want it. But this is not the only reason they're here. Because they have feelings, okay? We're also going to look at feelings as well, but still... I already see it here. They want even for some, they even want a family with you. Wow, beautiful pile number three. Beautiful energies. I love it. And let's see more. What are their thoughts that maybe they're not telling you right now? What are their thoughts about you at the moment you're watching? Uh, yes, they... Um, if you have differences in you, like maybe different uh, religions, different uh, ethnicities, different age, whatever it is. Maybe you live in different countries. Doesn't have to be. But this difference between you, they love it. They love that you have, uh, even maybe if you have different interests, they love to hear about yours. They love this, um, that you're not boring to them. Because all the time they, if they speak to you, all the time they find something new about you. Like they're like, wow, in their head, wow, uh, they're doing this, they're doing that. Uh, they're interested in this and that. I never even knew there is a thing maybe that you're doing. Let's say, just an example, right? You're spiritual or you do tarot cards, right? And they hear it in the first time, right? You might think, okay, uh, they might, they probably think that uh, something wrong with me. But no, they love it. They love the differences uh, between you. They love this, that you are so talented, maybe, or you do things that they even never, like, thought about that people can do. This is just an example. You take it as it resonates with you, or maybe you um, volunteer to help people, right, for free. At your free time even though you maybe you're working a lot but you still find time to volunteer right and they're like okay how great is this person they they take the time from their schedule just to help people for free and they adore it they love it in you that you are not like everybody else i hope you got me here guys right at least you're not boring for them. Every time they hear you, they always like find something new about you and they love it. For most here, you didn't have anything with this person yet. I mean, like you, you, I, you, I, I think you didn't have sex with this person yet. Uh, even if you did, they still all the time finding new things in you every time they have you. Yes, they also feel that you are so... Um, attractive and people adore you people around some other people also like you um because you it's like you are, you are the star and they look at you and they're like wow this person is really um attract attract other uh, people a lot maybe you are popular i don't know doesn't have to be but at the same time, even though you're popular maybe, or you're not afraid to show yourself, or like uh, you are not shy, but at the same time, they still feel that you um, have your inner um, world that no one knows about. There is certain inner world in you that uh, they want to figure out where you are shy, you are, uh, you have certain fears maybe, but you never show them and they want to figure it out in you. Why? Because they love everything about you, uh, including the things that uh, maybe your fears, including the things maybe, maybe you barely sleep at night, even though you show to the world that you are fine, but you are not fine. Maybe you have certain difficulties or maybe you're going through um, a difficult relationship and you're not showing it to the world, but you show that you're completely fine. But uh, deep in your heart, you hurt. 
and they can feel it. This is again just an example. And they love everything about you. This person is really adores you. Adores you guys. Wow. Yes, they have feelings, King of Water, I see here. And they and they love how you can stand your ground, how you not afraid of to um if somebody like say something to you, you're not of afraid to, you know, talk back. You're not the person who will um give an, uh, some other people, random people to hurt you, let's say, or, um, you know what I mean? You're very strong here. Beautiful. But at the same time, they feel like that you are stable. Let's say if you love someone and you have certain connection, you wouldn't run around for other places. You would stay there because uh, if you're comfortable with someone, uh, you don't need anybody else. You don't need because you are a stable person. You're a faithful person when it comes to a healthy connection. And they feel that you want a, a, a stable family maybe or a good relationships. You want them. But it's not easy. Right now you might go through something and they feel it. They feel that you... Um, in a certain situation and they really want to help you here somehow but let's see more into their feelings right now let's see more into their feelings i love it pile number three wow yes with the justice uh they do have feelings it's a major arcana and um those feelings are true those feelings are not um when they like you and then there's passion and then the next day they forget about you. No. Those feelings are very stable and fair. Yes. Uh, they feel very romantic when they think about you. They want to date with you even. Yes, they love you. I don't even want to open up more cards. They love you. Two of cups. See it for yourself. Uh, so this person really adores you and uh, we're not looking right now if they're gonna do any actions uh, we're just looking at their thoughts and feelings while you're watching this reading and I love it pile number three I hope you do too uh, let's see a message from them from their soul okay <laughs> you are everywhere I go so this person really really into you uh, they Wherever they go, they see, let's say, uh, someone looks like you. They start uh, looking for something that, uh, some certain features that uh, like yours. And uh, it's like they see you everywhere they go. They really dream about you guys. Uh, could be you just met recently, you started dating, started, or maybe just your secret admirer. Uh, but this is a you know great person and don't miss out guys because this person could really bring you what you want in this life and first and foremost is love okay thank you guys thank you pile number three please like subscribe comment and i'll see you in another reading bye bye